Hey guys, this is Zane here, and today we're going to be talking about one of the most underused guns in Titanfall. Now, this is one of my favorite weapons. Um, it wasn't at first. I thought it was absolutely terrible, like I'm sure most of you did do, but this is the Spitfire LMG, that amped card right now. Uh, this is going to be a short, sweet video. This is just going to show you the, the damage potential that this gun has. Now, this gun does have quite a bit of recoil, but if you manage to stay in close and personal, you can absolutely absolutely shred people with this. I hadn't used this gun barely at all until I reached um, generation 2 and then I started getting a little bit more amped cards of it and I started using it. It's mind-boggling the amount of damage you can dish out to people. Like you'll see some of this kill streak that I go on right here. Um, I would not have been able to do that with any other weapon. Maybe the shotgun but as you see here I'm about to go and just fucking spray and pray like crazy and just murder these guys. And luckily they got, they came and um, they triple teamed me at the end and kind of threw some arc grenades on me. So that was the only way they were going to stop me. Because I was just completely blind. But I was murking on them hard fucking core. Alright guys, so as long as you stay in up close and personal with this gun, you will destroy with it. I am using the amped version, but the regular version is just as good in close quarters. Like I said, make sure you try to stay as close as possible to these guys, otherwise the recoil is going to kick like a bitch. Even with that high recoil though, you can still take out some enemies from longer ranges, but it, it, it does become a little bit more difficult to use. Uh, at actually in close range, if you use it, I feel like a lot of people aren't using this for close range. Um, if you use this for close range, it's the easiest weapon to use out, it, out of any guns in the game. It's easier than the shotgun because the shotgun you have to be at least a little precise. Look at this. I can't even fucking see because of these shitty iron sights, and I'm just spraying, hoping I kill somebody. It takes so little. I don't exactly know how much damage um, each bullet does on this gun, but it's a ridiculous amount. It just tears through people. Like I said, you can still do well with it um, on long distance. It just takes a little bit more managed recoil control. But look at this guy. He thinks he's safe. No, he's not, because I'm just going to spray and pray and murder his bitch ass. Look at that. This is an LMG. And you see how fast that recoil is? Oh, he thinks he's good. No, he's not. Took out two people. Any other gun, I would have been dead right there. I should have been dead with this. That was just, that's a little bit lucky, and also a little bit that this gun is just badass. Now, here's where it gets real. Check it out. Take one guy out, no problem. His little buddy is going to be looking for him. Oh, shit, somebody's dead in there. Ooh, I'm going to till both of them right there. They're both fucked. They're both dead. Sucks to be you guys. Come in with a pistol, and I kill them. Then I get my ass double arc grenaded, and boom. I'm going down. But there you go, guys. Give this gun another try, and make sure you use it in those close quarter combat situations, and I promise you, you can fuck some shit up. This is Saiyan, signing out for Saiyan and Raxon. Be sure to check us out on the next one, and I'll see you later.